Alright everyone, this is uh, Angry Echo 6. I'm going to give you a down and dirty tutorial on how to use a few of the support modules in the editor, namely for uh, Kilo Transportation, using the MH9 or the KA60, what have you, and uh, the artillery functions for fire support. So, let's do this. Yeah, go ahead, open up the editor, Stratus. All right, here we go. Let's uh, let's find a nice little spot to set up somewhere. All right, we'll go ahead over here. This old uh, little compound dealie. All right, so we're gonna start by placing just a regular unit, so the you know, rifleman. Here we go. Uh, blue form and yep, rifleman got it. Now we're going to place a static unit using uh, artillery class static mark six mortar all right there we go notice this uh, this blue line we got right here this sky blue line light blue whatever uh, that's indicating the group and we're gonna ungroup everything uh, towards the end so don't you fret all right now since we've got our rifleman and our mortar system let's go ahead and put in some support modules that we can utilize this stuff properly so over here we got the modules the three little boxes all right the first one we're going to use is under the supports category and it's going to be support requester that's you requesting support from somebody pretty self-explanatory uh, over here you've got your limits uh, negative one being the default, which means you can call it in as many times as you want. You can change that value, you know, for limited transports, limited artillery, everything like that. So we're just going to leave it negative one for now. All right, there's your support requester module. That's we're going to move that guy over here. Now we're going to set up another support module. This one's going to be support provider artillery. As soon as we have physical artillery, you could use the virtual one and you would not need this Mark VI mortar and it would just kind of be ghost artillery. All right, now we're going to link them all together. Actually, disregard that. We're going to ungroup them. To ungroup them, a little group of people here. Notice we've got these sky blue lines in between our mortars and our support modules. We're going to ungroup them. Simply click on it, drag into empty space, and release. There you go. Line gone. Boop. Same there. All right. Those guys are ungrouped. Now we're going to synchronize using the chain. So we're going to chain them all together. So we've got our artillery piece or our mortar, the support provider artillery. Those two are going to be linked together. And then the requester to the provider module. Notice the darker blue line that has shown up. And requester to rifleman. So basically the way it goes is the rifleman talks to the request is the requester, so they're linked. The requester talks to the provider, provider talks to the equipment. Alright, so we've got that. Pretty simple. Now let's put in a helicopter. So we'll go up here to units. And we'll do blue four air MH9 for transport. Okay. He's sitting right there. Nope, he's grouped. We don't want them grouped. Ungrouped. Good. Now we go back down here to modules. Uh, support provider helicopter transport. And we'll click OK. And there's that nasty grouping. And now we'll link them. We will link the MH9 to the helicopter transport module and the requester module to the helicopter transport module. So you can see. Oh, I broke it. My apologies. There we go. Now we see we've got the your player guy here. The requester module linked to the artillery, linked to the helicopter transport, and then to the transport helicopter and the mortar system. All right, there we go. That's what we got going on right there. Now, just for shits and giggles, let's go ahead and 
put in some people out in the distance over here-ish. So we'll throw in an op for infantry squad. That should be good range. Okay. So we're going to save as uh, module blah. And let's preview it. Now, as you can see, we've got our mortar and our MH9. And where exactly did we put those guys at? All right, there we go. We've got our infantry squad from Op4, roughly a click out. All right, now to utilize your support assets, you're going to hit the tilde key, or the one right next to the one on the top of your keyboard. That's going to bring up your communication support. So, using your middle mouse, you're going to, you know, select communication. You're going to communicate with your artillery strike. Which asset do you want to use? You can set up multiple assets. We're going to use the Mark VI mortar. And we're going to call in an eight-round volley on those grunts down there. Requesting immediate artillery support at the designated coordinates. Over. Target location received. Ordnance is inbound. Out. Flash. Out. Round complete. Out. And we have a lone survivor. Oh well, we'll leave him be. He suffered enough. Okay, now we'll uh, attempt to make the pilot do what he's supposed to do. They have a tendency to not like to land where you want them. So again, using the tilde key, uh, communication, helicopter transport, select the asset. Requesting airlift at the designated coordinates, over. Air taxi on the way. He's not going to spool up and leave because he's in such close proximity to you at this time. But if, say, if you were on the other side of that mountain and he was down at the Stratus airfield, he'd come and pick you up. Everyone in? Let's get out of here! Okay, now, using my little cursor dealie there, let's see if I can get him to take me about 500 meters down the road. Okay, I messed up. I didn't want to get out of the bird. Requesting airlift at the designated huh. coordinates. Over. Roger. Air taxi on the way. So you see after you call it in, that's when the pilot will spin up the bird.
shed a little bit of light on the confusion of using the support modules. Uh, if you've got any questions, comments, concerns, bitches, moans, gripes, feel free to go ahead and comment. I'll address the questions and the answers and you know, concerns, uh, bitches, moans, and gripes. Guess what? I'm learning the editor too, so man up, do your research. Echo 6 out.